Okay. Hey guys, um, Alpha Papa Nobu here. So before, it, um, I'm, I'm gonna come out in the video saying to buy a, a TP Link, whatever, whatever. Do not buy the one that I unbox because it's just a nightmare. It's gonna give you kernel panics. I mean, it was just a big nightmare for me. Like I didn't know because since I couldn't get online before I installed it, after I installed it, when I got online. I was getting kernel panics so I noticed it was my network that as soon as I got online or went to download something or surfing the web I'll get kernel panics it took me three days to figure it out that it was the wireless card that I bought the one that I'm gonna unbox so what I did is I went back and I um, traded it for this one and this one works fine this one works perfect what I'm gonna do for you guys is I'm gonna um, I'm gonna link you guys to the website where I read about the the wireless cards, the PCI cards. Um, I'm gonna give you guys the link, but um, you want to go with this. You do not want to go with the one I unbox. Do not buy that one. Go with this one. This one's working perfectly fine on my Alienware Area 51. Um, I turned it into a Hackintosh. I, I'm dual booting. Everything works perfect now. I figured out the lights. Let me go the camera. Um, now I turn it on. I f everything works. The lights work. As you can see, um, there is the wireless card that I bought. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. Uh, you're probably not. There's two cards in there. There's um, one for um, video capturing, which I do the gaming with. And then there's the other one for... Um, the other one's for... For the wireless um and dual something there they are maybe you can see them now if i like point the light at them oh well um so this is my alienware guys it's running mac os right now here it is um the lights work everything works on it there you go um the top lights there they are working this is the back of it mm, there's the wireless card right here there are the antennas I don't know if you can see them or not if you can I apologize here's the other side so the, everything's working on it well, I have a few things that don't work on it, but I'm pretty sure I can figure them out. Like my um, ESOT, that's not working. But I figured I, I got to figure that out. So, this is the website I'm going to link you guys to. This is the first one I bought right here. That's the first one that I bought. Do not buy that one. I mean, it's up to you, really. If you want to buy it, buy it. I strongly recommend for you not to buy it. For the simple fact that it's just kernel panics, kernel panics kernel panics and it just like it won't let you do anything i tried everything every single thing that was on the web every single thing and it just didn't work for me i went and i i traded it for this one at fries and this one's just working like a dream not even once i haven't even once got a kernel panic all right with that said let's get to the video hello youtube this is alpha papanovi and um i'm gonna be doing an unboxing of uh, d link extreme and desktop pci express adapter um the reason that i went to go buy this was because um i own an alienware and i recently got into the hackintosh scene the hackintosh community i've been watching a lot of videos um if i show you guys i'm gonna be installing this on my air alienware area 51 for the hackintosh because I have looked for the driver for um, land drivers and I cannot seem to get it. I, I, it won't work. Like I have installed everything for Multibeast. Every single driver, I tried them all and they just don't work for me. I don't know why, but I went online. I did a lot of research, went online and supposedly D-Link works right out of the box. Like you don't have to do anything. Just install it, fire up your computer, and it should work. You should have internet. Um, wireless. 
I'm gonna show you guys the, the computer right now. Um, my cameraman gonna give me the camera. I'll show you guys around the computer. Uh, it's a random case right there, a phantom case. Uh, this is my Alienware. So, um, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see, I have a Apple cinema display. It's not the Thunderbolt because the Thunderbolt wouldn't read my my graphic card. So I bought it, but then I had to take it back because it was worthless. I couldn't use it. And I have an iMac. I had an iMac before. Um, I had dual iMacs before actually, but um, I sold one because I mean I needed two. I just needed one. Um, this iMac is. Let me show you guys the spec on it. Uh, but this Mac. Sorry if the camera is shaking or whatever. Um, so this is the, it has a 2.93 gigahertz Intel Core i7, four gigabytes of memory of DDR3 and Lion. So I'm gonna fire up the Alienware, which is running. I have, I, I have it doing uh, dual boot through, um, uh you see something i don't know I'll show you guys right now like i said i'm not a pro if you can hear it sorry that's the fans kicking in i'm not a pro at um the hacking touch scenes but i'm trying to learn it have taken me two weeks to basically i did a lot of research and everything there's the um alienware logo this comes up like this Ah, there we go, the Alienware. It's gonna, um, can you please turn the light off? It's like reflecting on the monitor a lot. So this is an Apple cinema display. Not that one, not that one, the other one. The one behind me. Well, still reflecting, but it doesn't matter. I need the lighting in, the light in here. So when the computer starts, I can um, press a key to, um, to choose where I'm booting from. I can boot Windows. Or I can boot um, Mac. There you go. And that is from the Alienware people. The only thing I don't have here, I have everything, is the um, LAN driver, the internet driver. And that's why I'm going to be unboxing this um, DVD. I'm going to post a. a, a I'm going to be posting a, um, on YouTube. Uh, let me start this. A link. To whoever wants to um, get this wireless um, adapter, it's a PCI wireless adapter. I, it's the best one that you can get. I'm pretty sure for Windows. I mean, it cost me like sixty bucks on price. You can get it on Amazon, I believe, or eBay for like forty bucks. Um, so this is this is it, guys. The lights don't come on, but it really doesn't bother me. The Alienware light is on. If I go to this about this Mac, um, so 2.81 gigahertz into a Core i7, 12 gigabytes of memory. If I go here, I'm running the latest um latest software by the way. 10.74. I don't know if you can see that on the camera. Pretty sure you could. Um, so. If I go to a display, Apple LED Cinema Display, I have it at 1920, 1080, but I, I can put it, the resolution higher. I have, um, this is the Windows partition, and this is my um, OS Lion partition. And this is my 12 gigs of RAM, as you can see, it's working fine. Um, if I boot it into the camera, it works. There you go. Hello, people. What's up? All right, yeah. Um, FaceTime works too. Everything works except the Land driver. Um, audio works. I don't know if you can hear that. Yeah. Um, this was just me being random earlier. So I was testing the. <laughs> I was just testing the audio, make sure it works. Uh, let me see what else. Uh, here's Multibeast. I have tried 
every single driver in this every single of these drivers I don't, I don't if you guys know a fix or anything my audio is the um uh the um let me see i have it i wrote it down uh broader band broad, broadcam netlink gigabit internet i installed that it doesn't work so i have installed uh, that's the graphics I installed uh, where is the network basically I installed all of these drivers I installed this one doesn't work which is real take gigabit it didn't don't work none of these drivers work uh, the audio did work that did install fine so I just went and bought this card let me get to it and unbox it so uh, let's take this plastic off. What's the point in here? Um, well, well, well. There we go. I should touch something like something metal. Just keep it there. Just keep it here. Like that. want to make sure I don't burn this or anything so what do we have here is trying to find my way into this this is probably gonna be a point to me this is probably gonna be a two-part video maybe three I don't know cuz um I don't like to make them longer than 10 minutes cuz people people usually don't like them or like this too much time 15 20 minutes uh, well let's get to it this is that's what comes in the box uh, we got uh, nothing in here that's it uh, the back of the don't move it too much um, so we got the link start here commence C commence C I don't know what language is that we got a star here, command CC, I don't know what language is that. Extreme and desktop PCI Express adapter. And then we have a guide, and that's basically it. And then we have, then we have the most important, which is the D-Link, and then we have the little antennas, they're gonna go on the back, and a small, um, it's like adapter for the smaller computers, I guess. That's that, the antennas, and this. Um, so I'm gonna put my computer apart. So I'm gonna unplug the, the Alienware. Uh, and I don't know if I'm gonna have an extra slot because I already have a capture card in there, which I do uh, my gaming recording with. I do a lot of gaming recording. Well, I kind of, Stop doing it for now because I haven't been feeling it or I don't know I haven't done it for like three months probably the last video I uploaded was about Diablo 3 and their servers error something like that um well I'm not claiming to be an expert on the hacking touch scene but I'm gonna try if you um, need help with anything, if I'm able to help you, I, if I'm able to do research, if I can help you install a driver or whatever, leave me a comment. I'll try my best. I'm not an expert. I barely started doing all this two weeks ago. As you know, I own an iMac. It's right there. But I really like to think of my computer and all that. Hopefully, I'll get better and better and better, and I'm going to be able to help you guys. So I'm gonna um, get the computer, the Alienware out. Um, and then once I have it out and everything, I'll set it up, record while I change um, the, while I put the D-Link. I don't know if I have an extra PCI slot, but if I don't, I'm gonna, because I have two graphic cards, 268, 70, Crossfire, you guys will see. All right, well, um, I'll come back.